it's, it's just like a pain to get all the parties to work together. Yeah. Um, well, probably not a big enough... Uh, I mean, we thought Marvel vs. Capcom was dead up until we yeah, heard about Infinite. Yeah. Anything can happen. Yeah. Oh, this is disgusting. It's a mine, bro. <laughs> yeah. Do I really have to commentate this? So, um... Sonic used to play, uh... Taker. Oh, really? He used to be uh, a grappler enthusiast as well, but... He decided he liked winning instead? That happened. <laughs> winning can do that. I understand. It's, yeah, if you start winning, it's, it's an intoxicating feeling. Yeah. Let's see. Ah, uh, 2C good. Their 2C looks giant. Like, that, that is actually insane. <laughs> like, whoa, what yeah. is going on there? He's got big buttons. Yeah. Oh, that's the guard break one, right? Yeah. Oh. You can barrier it, of course. Okay. That, that super, I swear, is the exact same one as a Hibiki. <laughs> But, like, Hibiki's isn't invincible, whatever is it? <laughs> well, actually, I don't think Dragoon is invincible, it's just very fast. Okay. About five frames for it. Yeah, it's hit it all the way up, it's pretty crazy. And the fact that it's a quarter circle means you can just rip it out on reaction very easily. So anyone's in the space above your head? Not anymore. Yeah. <laughs> no fly zone. That is insane. He that super fight. Still plus. Uh, yeah, he just can do it. That's the other weird thing, that she has dive kicks that are plus on block. That and hand, yeah. they hit both sides. But it's so counter to do with it. I think there will be some irony if uh, Shaka loses. <laughs> I think it's a uh, poetic justice. Yeah, that's pretty funny. But he's going for an air reset, maybe. Whoa. Oh, he was trying to... Oh! <laughs> wow. <laughs> Like, of course it would end that way, right? Well, that's what he was going for. So he, yeah, he, he did the like, true C, he left him in the air, he was and like, I, think I, don't he care. Was, I think he was just buffering Dragoon. Yeah. He's like, if he presses a button, if he air dashes, I've got this round. Yeah, like, he he wanted him to block it. Yeah. 100 meter mix-up. Hey, 100 meter mix-up is still a mix-up. Dude, if you got that 100 meter, and it just, you just need that one little hit, right? You just gotta clutch it out. I mean, I, I play Tega, one of my favorite things is Magnetech Wheel Rapid. <laughs> yeah, that is the cheap. Oh my goodness. Just do it. That is the cheapest thing, because it's like, oh no, he did it. <laughs> if you spend 100 meter and you hit them, <laughs> it was worth it. Yeah. Oh, uh, that too. See? Oh, oh no. You got the height. He missed a little bit of it. Just get a little antsy. I'm going to try to antsy here with his own. Uh, his tab, so. Ooh, it blocks. Get the crouch confirmed, yep. So what exactly are uh what are my it, it seems like so, I don't really know what you would exploit to beat her, it seems like she just kinda gets hit in control. So she's very much a character who hits down and in front of her. Okay. So she does spend a lot of time with that super jump height just like that, right? Yeah. But if you can get above her, not yeah, obviously watch out for two C, yeah. but if you can get above her in the air. It's easier. Except for that. Oh. Wow. Okay, you know what? Forget I said that. <laughs> she has no fly weaknesses. zone. No, I mean, in general, a lot of uh -huh. her pressure is not solid. A lot of it has gaps that can be exploited if you know where. Uh -huh. And her neutral... I can't tell because... It's not that solid. She'll do a lot of jumping around. She'll do a lot of dive kicks, but you can call them out. Yeah. Well, I mean, it Does seems like... Yeah. Her, her other weakness, of course, is no meterless CP. Oh, yeah. She does have a backdash versus low in bomb from frame one. Uh -huh. But if you call it out. Yeah, that's what I was about to say. Like, she seems like she had a pretty decent like, movement to get around things. Uh, and that, that backdash, the, the reversal. Yeah. You know. But Shaka brings it back very quick two rounds there. Yeah, you literally gave me the, uh, the Blaze Blue Wiki description of my round was over. <laughs> <laughs> Super fast. So it's 1-1 uh, one, one to see if Shaka actually got that down for if it took that long. He's the whole time he's just getting ready. He's about to... Uh, you know, took the burst there. Both bursts. There's right the guard crush right there. He was not barriering. And it opens straight up. 3.5. I'm assuming that's like plus then if you, uh, if you barrier it, right? Let's double check. Yeah. Not I know that even if it's not plus, uh, it leaves you at a range that a lot of characters are on challenge. That makes sense. I mean, look at the range. Yeah. <laughs> you think Ragnar can, you know, yeah, he's, trying, he's trying to 5B it back? 
Oh, but let's see if Phantom Thief can steal the route back. <laughs> oh, he cannot. Oh, wow. Oh, that is and the power a, of fate. That's a, that's a trophy-worthy moment. <laughs> he hits a Dragoon, jumps, gets Dragoon. <laughs> what did he think was going to happen? Yeah, I know. I was like... <laughs> oh, he, so didn't, he didn't get the second hit. Now Shark has put him in the corner. Safe jump. Oh, great. Oh, good 2C back though. It doesn't convert. It hit him so high, I'm not sure if he was ready to convert. Oh, that's one of those command pops. I see. He was just waiting for that. Yeah. It. it looks like Shaka is just going to start playing way more solid. Just kind of waited for Phantom Thief to make some mistakes. Here right? we go. Dragoon 1. Dragoon 2. <laughs> you know he was going to RC it too. He was like, yeah, I don't care. Yeah. Actually, I think Phantom Thief wanted to RC his, but he was like two or three minutes short. Oh. So I wonder if he could have done maybe like a side swap combo. Uh-huh. But... It's not the way it went. <laughs>